Hello everybody, welcome to the vlog. Ignore the sound of the air conditioner. It is fall, but still 90 degrees here in East Texas, so we're running the air conditioner because we're sweating. But we're actually on our way right now to the church. We just left the church, got our stuff, going back um, so that we can head to the Gateway Conference, which we're so excited about. We have a vlog from last year from the Gateway Conference. That was our first time ever going. And um, we're about to go again. So we are headed back to the church to get on the van and head to Dallas. So let's go, it's gonna be a fun vlog. Okay, so we are in the hotel. Um, also, Manny, I forgot to tell you that I got a compliment on this shirt in Starbucks. A lady said, like, cool shirt, or nice shirt, or something like that. It's really nice. This is one of the shirts that we made with good designs. So, the back of it's cool too. It says, I am chosen. Um, but yeah, anyway, so this is the cool little sink in our hotel. We're at Comfort Inn. Um, so yeah, you walk in, there's that. Hotel room tour, I like to watch those, so we'll do it. Small little bathroom. Toilet in the, uh, <laughs> Manny just threw his phone. He also fell out of the van, so. Um, but anyway, and not like we need a big bathroom anyway, because it's got this nice little area to get ready, so that's good. Um, I really like that headboard. But this is a room, it's really nice. Actually, these colors remind me of New Mexico. Santa Fe, that's like every color everywhere is that like brown color. But anyway, so yeah, it's a really nice room. Smelled really good when we walked in. Got this little area over here. So yeah, really clean, really good. Little outfit mirror. Ooh, I can take my outfit pictures in this. That'll be good. <laughs> so it is 4.18 right now. I'm probably going to call my mom and show her the room because she always likes to see that. And then we have to head back down at five o'clock. Yeah, I got it. Five eleven and it starts at six. Oh, they've got trains on the side now. Just oh yeah. Up. Got our bags. Hey Rob, did you say that that is doing a culture worship? Oh, I was hoping he was gonna do something like that. Yeah. Here we go. Our little schedule. And our little bags.
All right, so we are back at the hotel. We went to dinner tonight at Panera. Um, and then after dinner, when we got home, or we got home, we got back to the hotel, Manny and I walked to McDonald's because it's across the street, and I got a chocolate dipped cone. Most McDonald's don't have those anymore, but it was so good. I have wanted one <laughs> for so long, and they like stopped selling them a long time ago, but apparently this one still sells them, so I was very excited about that. But then we came back to the hotel after McDonald's, and I filmed this entire clip that I'm filming right now and realized that I had chocolate from the cone on my nose, the whole clip. And I didn't know until I was editing this video. So it's already edited at this point. I just have to put this clip in. So normally I just keep it real and I would leave things like that in a video. But I couldn't. <laughs> I had to refilm that one. Um, but anyways, so Gateway Night of Worship was amazing, like you would expect. Um... It's awesome. They do everything really well at Gateway. I think I said that in last year's vlog. Um, last year, I put all the days together and just made one vlog out of it, but I'm going to do separate days this time and edit them at night. But anyway, so it was amazing. And really cool thing is that last year, after I uploaded my vlog uh, from the conference, the team at Gateway reached out to me and said they'd seen the video, and um, they were so glad they had a great time, you know, all that kind of stuff. And um, they... Honestly, when I first read it, I thought that they were going to, like, yell at me about something in the video. <laughs> like, I thought they didn't want something to be, you know, recorded or something. I don't know. Because I wouldn't expect that they would be, like, just saying that they liked it. They literally, like, went out of their way to tell me that they were glad that I, you know, had a fun time. And they also asked me if I would send them a story. You know, like, my, um, my experience, basically, at the Gateway Conference. So I did that. And then, um... This year, they, I want to say they remembered me, but I'm sure I wasn't, like, at the top of their, you know, mind, but they probably had set it up this way to where it would, um, they would reach back out to me this year, and, uh, because I know they're super organized, and they have, they have their stuff together at Gateway, but, um, anyway, they emailed me again, and, um, told me, it was the same lady that I had been talking to, she emailed me again, and, um, asked me if, you know, I'd want to meet with the social media team while we were here at the conference and kind of do like what she called like a little interview with them. Just like asking how I got started doing what I do and that kind of thing. So we're going to do that at some point while, um, while I'm here, as long as they like have time for it and all that stuff. I know they're super busy, but if they reach out, I'd be glad to do it. Um, so yeah, if you are, man, just threw something against the wall, but if you are from Gateway and watching this, because apparently people watched it from Gateway last year, which makes me really happy. Um, then thank you for reaching out to me. Oh, also, I forgot to mention a really important part, 
when they reached out last year, they actually said they would give me a ticket, just a free ticket for this year. And they did that. And so that was, like, really exciting. Um, they gave me two free tickets. Two codes. Two codes. Yeah, that's what it was. Two codes for uh, me and Manny. Right? For me and you? Yeah. I always forget because it's literally been a year since they did it, which is so crazy. They, were, like, literally reached out to me a year later. But, yeah, they gave me two codes. Two, basically, tickets um, for the Gateway Conference, which... It's just like they do not have to do that. The gateway conference is not cheap for good reason. Like they have so many things. Um, it really is a good price for what you're getting out of it. But anyway, um, it's just really nice of them to offer that and to literally give that to me just for no reason. It's not like I'm a big influencer. It's not like the video is like a viral video or anything. I think it has like over 200 and something views or something like that. So it wasn't like it was really like necessary for them to do that. Not that it would be if it was a big video, but um Anyway, it just really made me happy, and that's not every day that something like that happens, so I was really thankful for that, really appreciative of it, and they just have an amazing team, and I'm really thankful that they reached out, but anyway, they do everything with absolute excellence. It's just so good, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video so I can get rested up. Tomorrow, we have to wake up pretty early, get ready, go down for breakfast, and then I'll vlog all that, too, so stay tuned. Anyway, hopefully there's no chocolate on my nose. If there is, I'm uploading this anyway. Um, thank you for watching. Remember, you are incredible. Jesus loves you. See you next time. Bye.